Good evening, I'm Victoria Idoni. And I'm Mark Kiesling. It's been a week since the city of Carbondale mandated wearing face masks in public. News 3's Maya Skinner spoke with the mayor and local businesses to see how the community has responded to it. Last Thursday, the city of Carbondale unanimously approved a face covering ordinance in response to a recent spike of COVID-19 cases in Jackson County. In the last two or three days, I've probably had 20 to 30 text messages, phone calls and emails about uh, customers not wearing masks in stores. Mayor Mike Henry says he's concerned about the community's health and safety. The university and the city are taking as many steps as we can to, to help stop the spread of of COVID uh, as our as our students return. And of course, we want them back here in town. Uh, but we also know that that age group is the demographic where the virus is spreading most quickly right now. Restaurants like Blend Tea and Crepe say 50% of customers wear a mask since the ordinance went into effect. They still will wear the mask, but if they don't want to, I think they still do the same thing. They won't just come in without a mask. Uh, maybe they forget it or sometimes they just come in. But businesses like Carbondale Cycle say customers have been following the order. Yeah, I see more than 90% people wear them. Sometimes they forget. Mayor Henry says he hopes people will comply and help reduce the spread of the virus. If we fail to enforce it properly and our number of cases keeps going up, the state governor will put us back. In Carbondale, Maya Skinner, News 3. Those who violate the order could possibly face a fine of up to $750.